Are you ready? Death count. Welcome, I'm Kamero Tetsuo, and you are watching Death Count, where I play video games on the hardest difficulty, and of course... Death Count activated. So, we left off last episode where we were going to go down, so let's go down. I have just a blue weed, so, yeah, that was good. I don't have to worry about poison, at least. Jill! Barry? Thank God you're safe. You too, Jill. A noise I heard brought me down here, but I didn't expect to find a place like this. Have any idea as to what might be at the bottom? There's only one way to find out. That sound. I don't know. I don't want to know. Could be a person. Jill, go check it out. Uh, what? We had enough surprises for one day. I'll stay here and secure our escape route in case something happens. Okay. Look at the size of your gun, man. You go. First, let me examine the area. Is this a chesticle? Of course, it's a. Uh, I need to go down there. Let me just let's just have a quick look. Quick look. Okay. All right. Anything down here? Nope. Oh. Garbage compact. There's a switch. No need. That was it. I'll stay and secure our escape route. You got it, Barry. Guard this elevator with your life. Special tactics and rescue squad service here to help. Okay, you don't need help. You are perfectly doing fine by yourself. Weed. Right, I'll mix one with a blue herb. Actually, I won't even mix it through it. Not yet. If I need room, I will. Okay, I need to look at the map. I don't know where I need to go. Okay, I need to go this way. That's the little girl, Lisa. Well, she's not little anymore. She's pretty much the... Been experimented on by so long by different scientists, but the main scientist that started experimenting on her last was William Birkins. I better hurry up and do this. I don't want her to enter in here. Uh, this box needs to be pushed on there. Put the T virus in her, you know, or you know, the first phase of the T virus, the progenitor virus, or whatever the hell it's called. I don't know. Two flowers plus another two flowers. Yeah, we know. It goes to T virus. Oh, well, the first version of the T-Virus. Starts with a P, I don't know, it doesn't come to my mind. Uh, Progenio virus, something like that. That's gonna head down to the compactor, so I'm gonna have to do that really quick. Also, since I already know, it has an item that I need. And yeah, over the years, she, her body, naturally made the first strain of the G virus so sh shit god damn 
She's almost like Leatherface. Okay, I need to come here to put that. Wait a second. Oh, it's a switch. Okay. So in that box is going to be an item that I need to use to put on the levers to unlock that door. There's a door there that's locked. Dickhead. Barry, why? I mean, you've saved my life multiple times, but what the hell, man? So yeah, as I was saying, uh, Lisa is the walking is a walking BOW, and her blood is pretty much the G virus. Not exactly exactly the G virus, but it's the first strain of the G virus, which William Birkin uses her blood to, you know, to create the G virus. Which the G virus is way more dangerous than the T virus because it causes extreme mutation. Like, for example, a flamethrower. Crushed flamethrower, though, because I had to crush it. Will you take the broken flamethrower? Yeah, I will. For example, one of the main traits of the G virus is a big eyeball and a protruding heart. Because the heart expands so much that it just bursts out of the chest. So that's obviously their weakness, and then they have a big eye, also like, not necessarily on the head, also on the, uh, pretty much it grows out of their arm, or their shoulder area, back area, those are the signs of the G-Virus. So if you see anything like that, it's more likely as the G-Virus. Damn it. Yeah, she has a let she has someone's face on the back. Okay, just need a Oh shit, what the hell she knew? I feel kinda sorry for her, man, because she is aware more or less. She just wants to play, but I don't want to play. I mean, she has to eat something, right? So, of course, she ends up probably end up eating an animal. So. This is the wrong way. She's at. Okay, yes, I know. Time ran out. Get back here. Damn it, she's back. Okay, pull it. Right. Sorry, Lisa, I can't play this anymore. Playing tag. Whoa, creepy. The desk is cluttered with old beat up dolls and used candles. So she obviously stays here. The fire has died out, but it still signs of use. Yeah, it's so sad. She's aware. She knows how to survive. Sadly, of course, she probably eats just animals and. I don't know, man. I don't want to think about it. I don't want to say she's a cannibal. Like, she eats people, but... Oh, shit. Don't bite me, snakes. Whew. Here's where she stays. 
bunch of photographs featuring a young girl decrypting various scenes depicting various scenes from her upbringing That is still warm. Okay, I hear something coming. Take it and run. Take it and run. Oh shit, there's a diary there. God damn it. I have to read it. I need the lore. Read the book. Read the book. Read the book. Okay, yeah, this is enough. Wait a second, there's something over here. Alright, that's good. That way I can just combine that. Pick this up. Yes. Weathered old barrels containing what looks like water. So there you go. She actually drinks regular water. Which of course, anything alive needs to drink water of some sort. Ah, the stone ring. Family picture and notes. There's something written on the back. November 10th, 1967. There it is. That's the first strain of the T virus. The progenitor virus administered to Jessica. That's Lisa's mom and Trevor's wife. The architecture. The architect. Administered virus type A. Plasmolizing the tissue during cell activation. Virus fusion negative. Action disposed. So she did not. Her body did not take. The progenitor virus well and she died. Lisa administered virus type B, pretty much. Uh plasmalizing the tissue during cell activation, virus fusion positive but delayed fusion. Body modification observed constant results. Status continue protective observation. George Trevor, huh? Terminated. Just died. They killed him. There's a journal left by someone. Okay, I feel dizzy after the shot they gave me. I don't see mom. Where did they take her? She promised that we would escape together. Did she escape alone or leave me behind? I found mom way together. I was very happy. But she was fake, not my real mom. Same face but different inside. Have to find mom. Have to give face back to mother. Okay, so she was already way infected with this progenitor virus and she was already mutating and whatnot. They had this step in a body body double pretty much that looks like the mom. Fill in as the mom just to keep her, you know, happy, I guess. But she figured it out and ripped her face off. I got mom's face back. There you go. Nobody can have my mom except me. I attached her face to me so she doesn't go away. So that's the face that's behind her back. It's the actually face of some girl. Some lady. Because the mom said because mom said when I meet her without her face. From inside box, scent of mommy. Maybe true mother there. Stone box heart. So there's a tomb. There's a, uh... It hurt. Steel rope in the way. Okay, so there's a, uh... Freaking, uh... Ah! Forgot the name. What's the name? A coffin. A stone coffin. Jeez, jeez. There's a stone coffin and her mom's in there. So, uh, yeah she's dead can't see mother because four stones and it's sealed tight okay this is familiar Back in the 
beginning. Back in the in I guess where the mom would live. Probably the family. Who knows? Someone lived here. Alright. Got what we needed. Uh this thing right here. We need this to proceed. This stone ring. So we're gonna have to head back to the mansion one last time and I hear a zombie. Very close. There you are. back zombies okay it's fine just to pick this up there we go that locks that door it's okay Boom. Alright. That's gonna unlock a door that's in here in the mansion, actually. This is literally gonna be the last time I'd be coming here, so I'm gonna go ahead and, uh. You know what? This is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go ahead and. Use these to unlock the door, come back here, and get the rest of the stuff that I need because I am never coming back to the mansion after this point. And I'm quite positive this guy will turn into a crimson now. If it doesn't, I will be baffled. There's an actual door back here. We know who's there. Use. Me. Get a few rounds off. I might have to make a trip back just to get, because I'm going to leave these two and I'm going to have some open slots to come back. So I'm back, I managed my inventory and I bought these two medallions and a healing item just in case. Let's open it. So I use those two items, I will run all the way back to my chest to get a few things.
I mean, I hope I can come back. I guess I'll find out. It shouldn't be a one-way trip. I mean, it better not be. Just been underneath the mansion the whole time. Barry, you dickhead. Jill, you're alive. I'm alive. I was worried because I thought you were. <sighs> really, Barry? Start talking. Calm down. I didn't want to do it. Believe me, I can explain. Don't lie to me. I mean, yeah, I mean, you said you did save me two times, so I will hand it to you. Thanks, Jill. And now we're even, Barry. Okay, this is simple. Barry will help out. I just need to knock that over. Uh, Barry, you gonna hit her? Shooter! Ow! Oh, shit! I had no idea you could fall off there. Hmm. Now I know. Thanks, Jim. Right, here we go again. Push it off on the Push it off on my turn. Keep shooting her, Barry. Good job. Not condole suicide. I don't believe that thing's really dead. Leave this place up to me and go on ahead. Okay. You're forgiven, Barry. Okay, watch my step because I can't just fall to my death. All right. Where am I? At? Still in the courtyard. Big metal doors. Uh, 
this is the whole part. This is the whole game has been leading up to this moment right here. I present to you the entrance of the hidden umbrella laboratory. This isn't the main umbrella laboratory, but it is one of them. It's probably like, it is the original probably. One of the originals. Okay, but I will not continue. I'm actually going to go back to the mansion and get two more items. I will be needing the ammo disc and the magnum rounds. So, I'll end it right here. Thank you so much for watching. And on the next part, we will go down into the laboratory of Umbrella. And, see ya. What the freak? God damn it. I am that house, and I need a few answers from you. But why are you in the loot anime crate? <laughs>